Radio check. Radio check. Prophet, you there? Comms were down. EM pulse just knocked out the network. Rash is AWOL. I must make him our highest priority, but Michael has your brief. Up, Prophet. Cell records tell me there's a Ceph mind carrier near your location. With your sensitivity to the alien influence, you might want to swing wide. Negative. The Ceph have one collective intelligence, a hive mind, and it's all dependent on the Alpha. Now he's free, they're all waking up. These mind carriers are part of that process. I need to get eyes on. A hive mind? But you have a lot of alien material in your DNA. I don't know if any of this is a good idea. Break, break! This is Tower 436! We're under heavy attack! Massive set forces are heading in our direction! Tower 436, this is ground Prophet, unit Theta check it 1. In. Run, we are four flying defenses. Theta 1, this is oversight! You have a large enemy force heading your way! I count eight! Rendezvous is still in the My fucking bedlam out here! Watch your six! Be safe! Fuck me, I thought the bastards on Lynchham were tough! Come on!
Get out! Psycho. Psycho? I hear ya. You need something? No. Just checking in. ETA at rendezvous about 30 mics. back online, but our field commanders are reporting revived Ceph everywhere. The dome perimeter hasn't been breached, but inside... My god. They're exterminating everything human. I need to find Rash. I'm... I'm not trained for anything like this! Prophet, heads up. There's a disabled pinger close to your location. With all this Ceph activity, it might become operable again. You think you should steer clear? Maybe. But if it has a power source, I might be able to make use of it. Set up shop above the skinning lab. Enter under Tower 1 Bravo. Well, I'll be there. You don't have to go back in there, Michael. I can work the suit cradle remotely. I'll be fine. More worried about profit.
down. There's still a way to go. Always gonna leave the fighting to me. Listen, there's not a single day goes by where I don't wish I was you. Even with all that God knows what hardware, wetware, Seth mutation bullshit going on under that skin of yours, I take it. Come on. Cell had me locked down here for months. Never knew how far they were taking this shit. just a matter of time before they put me into one of these things. Because that's what the nanosuit is, right? A Ceph exoskeleton. Cell bastards. I'm gonna make you fucking pay! You bastards! Where the fuck are you? Psycho. If I could find the cell bastard who did this, I'd fucking kill him. Come on. This is it. Claire, open the door. Hold on. Yep. 
Halfways. Calibrating sensor remotes. There's a slight delay. Compensating. We're in. Locked. Have a seat, mate. We have to be sure about this. Unlocking the suit means breaking the safety seals, rerouting the nanites. If he's infused with Ceph technology now, there's no telling what he'll become. You can handle this, right boss? Do it. I'm accessing the memory retrieval systems. Filtering. Blockers are cleared. I'm registering critical neurological changes. We should be able to make a clear link with the Ceph now. What's this? Michael, you shouldn't. Don't. Well, why not? It won't help. Operation. The nano suit is then fully removed. Subject 8A, Sergeant Michael Sykes, is. Uh, He's still functioning at near optimal levels, but accelerated degradation is to be expected. You... You did this to me. Michael, please listen to me. You are the reason why. I... I mean, I fight Cell because of you, because... Is that why you cared? Or were you pretending to care because of this? Because of your own fucking guilt? I didn't have a choice, Michael! The cell program, we were in debt, you know how this works. I was forced to do this. To all of those people. I had to listen to their screams day after day after day. I know what I did. Jesus, believe me, I know. And I'll have to carry that with me as long as I live. Every day of my life. Michael! And feeling bad about it makes it all right, does it? If you're so fucking sorry, Claire, how come I had to find out like this? Why didn't you just come clean, you lying Michael, fuck? Michael, listen to me. You know how it works. You know she didn't have a choice. She did what she had to do. No choice. Just doing what she's told. Just following orders. Who the fuck does that sound like, Prophet? I'll tell you one thing though, she was right about you. You might as well be a fucking machine because you sure as hell ain't no human being anymore. I mean, you never were much good at it to begin with, but Jesus Christ, look at you now! Whose face are you wearing under that helmet these days, Prophet? Do you even have a face anymore? We all had to make sacrifices. You had a choice, mate. Everyone has a choice. Look, I told you. Everything that you needed to know. Remember these. All the men who died under your command because you were just following orders. Because you had no choice. Just like her. Psycho. No, mate. You take that suit of yours. And you go fight your own battles. Like always. Mike! Wait. No, Claire. He's right. Let him go. Oh, God. 
We just got intel on Red Star Rising. Listen carefully. Archangel is a key regulator platform in Cell's new wireless energy grid. But that's not all it does. The system's massive power store can be discharged via a broad area directed energy weapon, meaning assured destruction of hostile elements and metropolitan area depopulation events. Protocols exist for Archangel to be retasked for a number of alternate outcomes. When that outcome is the threat of Ceph Stage 3, Archangel begins the most aggressive protocol set available, Red Star Rising. Oh, God. They're gonna obliterate New York. Total. Orbital. Annihilation. Why can't Cell stay out of my goddamn way? I need to get everyone out to the perimeter. You're wasting your time. I have to save as many lives as I can. No. It won't matter. It's not gonna be like Link Shan. Archangel has a massive global energy store. They feed all that power back into the Alpha Sep and it'll punch one hell of a hole in the Earth. There'll be no Earth left. So what can we do? Connect to a Sep mine carrier. If I can get inside their heads, maybe I can reverse the awakening with them all back to sleep. If there's no Sep threat, Cell will call off Archangel. You're going to link yourself to the Sep? Prophet, you struggled to resist their influence even when your mind was protected. We've turned those safeties off now. That means the nanites in your suit are free. That means they can transform into anything, any form imaginable. You could actually become a Seth. That's a risk I'm willing to take. Oh, 
thoughts and the power, it's all the same thing. If I can only... Shit. What's that? The real Alpha Seth. Get out of there, Prophet! 